All right, guys, welcome back to another true story animation reaction video. Today, we might learn a thing or two. I found a hack that makes any girl fall in love with me by Storytime Animated. Hmm, let's find out what this hack is all about, guys. I'll leave all the links down below to the original video. Make sure you guys go check out Storytime Animated. Huge shout out to them. I'm leaving a like on this. Let's get started. I blew out the candles on my birthday cake after my parents Happy told me birthday. to make a witch. It was just my parents, my Uncle Alfred, and me, as okay, always. Okay. Don't think it was a sad birthday party for me. It was all I no had ever known. Or so I was as happy as nah, I could be. Nah, it's because of COVID. What did you, you know? wish for, champ? Asked my dad while cutting the cake for all of us. I wished I could go to school. Dang, I said. That I, was one solid piece of cake. Did you get did, did My dad you guys while cutting it? the cake for all of us. It went, I wished I could go to school. Is that I said. frozen? I didn't mean to make Better them be feel bad, cake. and I was happily surprised when my mom grinned and nodded at my uncle. Please, take a second to hit that subscribe. like and subscribe, subscribe button. Subscribe. What are you so smiley about, Mom? I asked her. Elias, why don't you open up your uncle's gift? <gasps> she asked me in return. What's he about my to get? My Uncle Elf placed a rectangular Ooh. box in front of me. It was pretty small. I undid Elf. the bow and opened His it uncle to Elf. find a pair of glasses. Ooh. I looked back and forth between my parents and my uncle. Maybe that's the hack. Maybe that's my a life, eyes are life fine. hack to get girls. Why should I wear glasses? I asked them. <laughs> my uncle took the glasses from me and showed them to me from every angle. I designed these puppies a while ago, Eli. What? They, they filter it out, he said. Huh? It took me a second to catch what he meant. They could fix my eyes? You see, I was born with a rare condition, oh. or curse as I like to call it, because it had caused me nothing but trouble and hardship. My parents told me that when I was born, the doctor who delivered me cried harder than I did the first time. Wait, because what? she couldn't bear to see me cry. They say she wouldn't let go of me, saying I was hers. My dad what? finally got a hold of me and gave me back to my mom. Someone came to get the doctor out of the room, but when the nurses came to check on me, they all had the same reaction Yo, as the doctor. This dude got a whole life hack, bruh. He can get any girl to fall in love with him. He had the doctor, the nurses, as a baby, guys. This, this man was pulling girls as a baby. Crazy game. They tried to snatch oh me out God, of my mom's so arms. Funny, dude. My parents had to fight people off just to take me home. <laughs> Anyone so who looked into my eyes, they, they became something. obsessed. Wow. My parents soon realized it wasn't safe for me to be seen. I've never experienced it myself because the only people I've met face to face Gotta are relatives and it doesn't work on them. Hey, how pretty I've simply are always eyes? trusted my parents Gosh. when they say I can't go outside. You mean I can finally? I asked in disbelief. If they work, you can go to school, said my dad, oh, squeezing that's my shoulder. Why he couldn't go to school. I had I wanted like, this forever. Just going to school. I had never been to school or to a party or Dude, to anything, really. He missed out I was on a 17 and had never seen a girl I wasn't related to, not oh. in real life. I put the glasses on and everything okay, looked okay. the same to me, which I was glad for. I was kind of scared they <laughs> would distort works. my vision. We have to try them out. It's the only way Let's to know to if the they real work, world. said my uncle. I was so nervous. Guys, I was he's shaking. been quarantined it was for the last 17 years outside. of his life. Basically. Because my uncle <laughs> said it was better to try them out at night just in case they didn't work. He said quarantine? So less people That's would see my you. eyes. My mom looked worried, but my dad threw an arm over her God, shoulders hey, and calmed don't her down. Don't worry. We'll be back soon, we'll be fine. said my uncle Elf. He put a hand on my shoulder and we Let's walked out works. onto the street. Yo, 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 yo just, just to get a girl, he just goes like this. Fox, we saw a he few people the and they didn't dude. have any reaction to seeing my eyes with glasses okay, on. Okay. But my uncle said we should try in better lighting. We saw a corner store and walked there. Right, he made me happened. go in myself to buy a candy bar and test out the glasses with whoever was behind the cash register. I walked in and did a double take it's because first there was a girl oh. behind the cash register. Okay, okay. Just my Let's luck. See if it the first girl I ever saw and she was absolutely gorgeous. Dude, she smiled at, at me that when point, I walked in. You just got to use your powers. <laughs> I gave her an awkward smile back and screw then the just sunglasses. looked down at the floor. Screw the, screw the glasses. I browsed the aisles, sneaking glances at her when I could. She wasn't looking back at me, so I guessed the glasses worked. Great, I thought. The one moment when I want my eyes to do <laughs> nah, the thing, nah, nah. they don't. You just, you just take off I grabbed the a candy bar and that. shyly walked up to her. I placed it on the counter between us and glanced at her. My palms were sweaty. Is that all? Arms she weak. asked. Her voice was like honey. I nodded because I couldn't get a word out. I haven't seen you around here before. Are you new in town? Nah, she asked I've been me here when she was getting my change. 17 years. 
You've probably seen me before, you just don't remember, I muttered. I think I'd remember those eyes, she smiled. I could feel myself <laughs> blushing a little. <laughs> totally embarrassing. He's like, she told me to have sure? a good night as I left, and no, I muttered no. a you too. No, My use uncle your was waiting outside, but the smile on his face told me he had seen everything. He gave me a playful punch on the arm and said, Bet you wish the glasses didn't work right now, huh? I <laughs> Just take him off right home. now. Just take him off. I asked him a million oh, questions it. about what it was like going to a real school because soon enough, it would be my first day. My dad well, dropped me off in front of the local high school a week right after now. my birthday. I walked in and he was, was immediately approached it. by a guy my age. He looked kind of geeky, up, but he was chill. He was asked to show me around because we had most classes together. He showed me all the important places, the told me certain now. things about certain people, and told me which teachers not to mess with. It was all intimidating, but at the same time, I was incredibly hyped to be there. The guy's name was Josh, and I spent most of the day following him around. When we went to the cafeteria for lunch, school got even better. Guess who I saw sitting on a table? <gasps> Wait, the, the, the girl, girl that works the at the corner store. Corner hey, store. Yo, this is your Josh chance, almost dude. had to pick my Dang. jaw off the floor for me. He grabbed my arm and sat me down She's at the, the table nearby. Girl at school. He started asking me what it was like to be homeschooled when the girl from the oh. corner store walked up oh. to us. Hey, you. She smiled at me. Hey, I didn't catch your name the other day. I said my name was hey, Elias, she's and interested. she told me her... Bro, he can pull even without his life hack. What a lucky dude, man. Her name was Angelica. It seemed fitting because she looked like an angel. Let's she sat down next here. to Josh really and the three of us here. talked until the bell rang and we had to go to class. Golly. A few months passed and I became really good friends with Angelica, but I wanted more. She got me a job at the corner she store said, so we could hang out friends. while I stocked shelves and she did inventory while sitting at the counter. Bro, she was a cheerleader Chico. and one night we were talking when she told me I should join the basketball team. By then, she knew I had been homeschooled for a long time, and I had told her that I shot hoops all the time in the backyard. Hurry up. He she told me I should try out well. for the team, so I did. As if I wasn't nervous enough trying out for the basketball team, the cheerleaders joined oh to watch, my gosh. including Angelica. I was How better at shooting hoops than the any of the other guys, thing. even the ones already the on the team. Suit. The next trial was that I had to play against the best oh, player. Oh, Stakes guys. were high. If I, I feel like... The glasses are gonna fall off. I don't think he knows that people fall in love with him when the glasses I won, come off. I could join. We were both sweating, both concentrating come on, man, just on win this. I finally jumped hey. in the air, and at the last he second, the, the ball, ball fell through the net, and I won. I ran up to Angelica, picked Dang. her up, and spun her around. She laughed super loud, and <laughs> that's when I knew I really had to here. ask her. Will you be he's my like, girlfriend? I blurted out. He's I really wanted like to facepalm. I was sweaty. Probably stinky, and she had just seen the ugly faces I make when playing basketball. Uh -oh. I thought I was about to get rejected in front of the most like, intimidating you know people at school. Yes. But then she said yes. Yo, I took her out really on a proper date here, to a bookstore cafe she loved, and I felt like the luckiest guy She's in like, the world. She's uh, like, why, why don't, why don't you take I was take doing amazing glasses? on the basketball team, and life was pretty much going perfect hey, for me. Life going My perfect, parents dude. were incredibly happy that I was finally able to have a normal life, normal and life. they were proud that I was doing so well in every aspect of school. This is so good. My Uncle Alfred occasionally checked up on the glasses, to see if they had taken any damage, but I kept them in perfect shape. I went to basketball training oh, every day after the school ball is gonna and hit, practiced at home too face because we had the biggest game coming up. We were going to play against uh -oh. our school's rival Oh my school. gosh. The day Jeez. biggest what game the coming up. Yo, yo, why does everyone have like normal size arms, but on this team, they're all jacked. We were going to play against heck? our school's rival school. Hey, yo. The day of the big match big finally match. arrived. Here we go. There was excitement in the air. Oh my God. Everyone was ready to support her, our team. Why is that girl? There was tension uh, between our school glitching. and the visitors. We were uncomfortable having them in our territory. Oh my God, these guys Before are the huge. match, we shook hands <laughs> with the other team. There was an unspoken rule to squeeze the other team's hands as hard as possible to intimidate them. Hey. The other team's coach came up to our coach, and they got into a heated argument. <laughs> they look the same. <laughs> no glasses. You better get four eyes off the court. What? The other coach shouted. What do you shouted, mean no glasses? What you if want he needs one to of my glasses? best players to play blind? How about I blind you? My coach what? shouted back. I was afraid this would happen, since I'm technically not allowed to wear glasses. Our principal uh -oh. got involved and settled the matter. My parents had told her that I could hardly see at all without glasses, so an exception was made. They're lying, though. <laughs> when the timer started, we became animals. Oh, My yep. team worked together like there a machine, and we were winning. He's a scoring Suddenly, machine. one of our best oh. players tripped and twisted his ankle. 
It all seemed oh, lost. Oh no, but we, we got an injury. I was running towards a teammate, oh, yeah. shouting I was open, when I saw some <laughs> jerk from the other school oh, flirting with Angelica. Oh my god, his girl's being hit on. Oh god, he's gonna get She looked uncomfortable, right trying to get away. Hey bro, get away I from I was too distracted girl. watching her, wanting to help her get away oh. from that creep that I didn't notice my teammate passing to me. He oh. hit me square oh, on the jaw, and I stumbled back. He's about to get all the girls now. This is this might be the best thing that happened to him. Watch. I felt my glasses Two, fall one. off. Everyone I shut my eyes, eyes fast enough for no one to see and kneeled down to look for them, still oh, with my it. eyes shut. I could hear everyone else around me still moving. And then I heard glass. Oh shatter. my god. People noticed Why? I was on the floor, so someone pulled His me own up. They kept shouting at me to just open my eyes, but I shouted back that I couldn't. His own I just teammate couldn't. stepped on his glasses. Then I felt someone shove me full what? force and I fell backwards onto the floor. Oh, maybe opening it wasn't my his eyes. teammate. I looked oh, around and everyone GG, went it's quiet. Over. Uh oh. I muttered. <laughs> the whole gym. I watched everyone's eyes go pink defense. and red for a second. Then they returned to normal. But they all looked like beasts. <laughs> they stormed towards me, almost tearing each other to shreds to get at me. Oh my god, I they ran all out of there him. as quick as I could. Bro, but they grabbed me. Not, even, my not only the girls, but all the guys too. I managed to make it through the doors, but they ripped Bro, part this of my is so jersey funny, off. Man. What? I didn't have a way to get home besides Maybe on this foot, life so hack isn't so great after all. He was I able to pull the girls with no my problem. school and Dang. half the other school running behind me. Oh, but no, I this didn't is stop. Bad. My eyes were open all the way home. So soon enough, I had this violent mob the of people, almost the entire town, after. running full speed behind me, oh my pushing each other down to get at me. I lost them Dang, for a that's second by dangerous. cutting through a forest and making it yeah, home. Yeah, this is actually kind of dangerous. When I ran in, my parents were alarmed. They're like, I told them everything help. that happened, and they ran to lock the doors. <laughs> my dad called my uncle, and they he said he'd be have home a security, soon. Uh, I ran upstairs with my mom and threw as many clothes as I could into a travel bag. How long will I have to leave for? I oh, asked her. No, I don't know, darling. My mom said, sniffing and caressing Dang, my they cheek. They made this so we heard like honking serious. downstairs, so I ran down and into my uncle's car. Oh my god! I saw the mob of crazy. people approaching. <laughs> this is actually drive, insane! Drive, I shouted at my uncle. Drive, drive. When we sped off, it's like a I whole zombie apocalypse, but he created the zombies. My uncle was blabbing on and on about trying to make contact lenses next time, but I wasn't listening. The amazing life I had slipped through Jeez. my fingers in now, mere now, seconds. Now someone's what? gonna, uh, someone's gonna take his girl now. What happened to Angelica? Will I ever see her again? Nope. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe, and turn on my post notifications if you guys want more true story animation reactions in the future. But other than that, see you guys in the next one. Peace.